Wild Feathers just might be the last great hope for rock played with a country twist instead of the new popularized country played with a rock twist. The Nashville-based band recently played a sold-out show at New York City's Mercury Lounge and are starting to garner buzz heading into the South by Southwest Festival. The band has quietly made the late-night talk show and huge music festival rounds, as well as open for Gary Clark Jr., Bob Dylan, Willie Nelson, Dwight Yoakam, and ZZ Ward. The group certainly has paid its dues. Their self-titled album was released last August, but they've been touring in advance of it from the beginning of 2013. The band talked about trying to break through as a rock band and as a country rock band in the day and age of pop and EDM. Um, I don't feel like we have to carry the torch. I just feel like we try to make the music that makes us the most happy and the stuff we like to play. And I think when we when we do it, I think it, it'll resonate with other people too. If it resonates with us, it'll resonate with other people if we're being honest and genuine to ourselves. So out of their many big time opening slots, who did they learn the most from? I think Willie Nelson, just as far as like, and everyone in his crew is his tour manager, how they run everything. He's the most loyal guy ever. Like some guys have been with him 30, 40 years. And he's just still as sweet and nice and cool as you could ever be. He could, he has every reason to be a dick or like, or, you know, an ass. Like he, he could be, but he's not. He, he's, he continues to be nice and treats people with respect and is just, you know, a normal, cool guy. And I think that's a, a great lesson to learn as a young band. Just always treat people good and, and I think good things will happen to you. I would, I would concur. Uh, probably the Willie tour for sure. While trying not to copy, the Wild Feathers talked about whose career they'd like to emulate. I think like a My Morning Jacket or someone's because the, the record sales are not like always just off the charts, but they are a great live touring band and they play amazing shows and they sell out huge places. So um, despite the record sales, they have a huge fan base and following. So I think that's that. I mean, that arc, that career track is something that I would aspire to. Yeah, I think all yeah. of us would agree with that. Totally. The Wild Feathers are currently out on a headline tour with Saints of Valerie and Jamestown Revival through March 5th ending with a show at the Troubadour in Los Angeles, California. All over me.